Brand new Air Evac facility is now open in Ardmore, T Tennessee. Way 31's Alex Torres Perez gives us a look at how it will help first responders better serve those of you near the Alabama Tennessee state line. Hopefully, I never have to use it, but it's nice to have it here in town. No, it's nice to have the you know that you can get someplace quick. It's a, the helicopter go, drives a lot. A lot faster to the ambulance can drive, especially on these roads. First responders say it can take 30 to 45 minutes for an ambulance to arrive in Ardmore. But now first responders can shorten that response time thanks to this helicopter that will fly patients to nearby hospitals. That's the number one fastest aircraft, strongest aircraft for EMS work. And so we fly basically two and a half miles a minute as the crow flies. So what that means is, you know, it, where an ambulance might take 20 to 30 minutes to get to a hospital, uh, we can get them there in 10 or 15. The Survival Flight 20 facility essentially serves four county areas, Madison and Limestone counties in Alabama, and Giles and Lincoln counties in Tennessee. We also can go for a lot further as a matter of fact, we ha actually have a 300 mile radius in which we can carry the life saving equipment and uh, personnel to the location. That includes Birmingham, Nashville, and even Memphis. We're just augmenting the availability of critical care to this entire region. And people in Ardmore, Tennessee, say they're great. We're just a small town. This is one of the best things that's happened to Ardmore in some time. 